I had three studies that I cite. One of them was by an anthropologist who just went to Colombia. She expects to find that evangelicals are patriarchal and controlling, and she found the exact opposite. She was amazed. She said that the machismo culture encourages men to be out in the public realm where you're drinking and smoking and gambling and visiting prostitutes. And she said when a man becomes an evangelical, he stops all of that and directs his money to his family instead. His family experiences a higher standard of living and they all do better. She says evangelicalism is the best women's movement in terms of the impact it has in the developing world. And then there was a much larger study done by a sociologist at the University of London. So she went to Africa and Asia, included that as well. And she found the same thing. She calls it the evangelical gender paradox because it's exactly the opposite of what critics expect.